10, a death investigation is underway in Pittston Township after a body was found behind the Ken Pollock Volvo car dealership today. Good evening, I'm Aaron Leedy. And I'm Ann Lurie. Parts of Highway 315 were shut down as authorities investigated. Fox 56's Alicia Hercules was at the scene and is live tonight with more. Alicia. Aaron and Ann, earlier today there was a heavy police presence surrounding the dealership after an employee made a 911 call after they discovered a body on the property. Uh, we uncovered the body of a 56 year old white male uh, behind one of the containers. It's in the very early stages of the investigation. At around 2.30 in the afternoon, the Pittston Township Police Department were dispatched after a body was discovered behind the Ken Pollock Volvo dealership. District Attorney Sam Sanguidoce says the man was employed by the dealership and was found by one of the other employees who then called 911. Upon receiving the 911 call, the Luzerne County District Attorney's Office was also contacted. The Pennsylvania State Police, as well as the forensics team, the Luzerne County District Attorney's Office, the Coroner's Office, and local police departments, including Pittston Township, Avoca, and Hughestown, were seen investigating the area. Investigators on the scene had the area along the parking lot of the dealership blocked off as investigators combed the area for evidence. A Dallas resident who wanted to remain off camera says he frequents the area to pick up his sibling from work. He tells me that hearing a body was found in an area with a lot of through traffic is disturbing. I mean, I'm surprised here in this area, especially. I mean, most of it back here is an industrial parkway. So, you know, I, yeah, I, I couldn't see. I, I mean, I couldn't see that happening. With the investigation being in its early stages, investigators are still investigating the man's death as well as the cause and manner of death. Um, there will be an autopsy scheduled in the near future. We don't have a time and date just yet, uh, but the coroner is going to be working on that as we speak. Now, the DA says it is far too early to determine if foul play was involved, but the case is still active. Reporting live from Pittston Township, I'm Alicia Hercules with Fox 56 News, first at 10.